We are conquerors. Sisi ni zaidi ya washindi. And more than conquerors. Zaidi ya washindi. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Because our war, warfare is no longer flesh and blood. Maana vita vyetu tena sivyo vya mwili. It's worse. Ni zaidi ya mwili. So get ready to conquer today. Basi kuwa tayari kushinda leo. Each one of you on your own. Kila moja wenu ukiwa peke yako. Don't expect me to come and pray for you. Usinitariji Tarajie nije nikufanyie maombi. We don't come kufanya maombi. Sisi hatukuji kufanya maombi. No. Hallelujah. What we speak is life. Tunapokuzungumzia mazungumzo hayo yenyewe ni maisha. And what we speak from here. Na kile ambacho tunazungumza toka hapa. Something will enter you that was never there. Kitu fulani itakuingia ambayo mbeleni haikuweko. The presence of Jehovah. Uwepo wa Yehova. The name is written here. Jina lake limeorodheshwa hapa. The father's name was there. Jina ya baba yake pia imeandikwa. Even his tribe is there. Hata kabila lilotoka liko hapo. Although we are not tribalists. Japo kwa sisi hatuendi kikabila. I wish I was a kikuyu. Laiti ningekuwa mkikuyu. Because, because today, today maana leo hii I would go all the way to Kisumu to preach. Ningeenda umbali wa Kisumu kwenda kufanya maubiri. To break tribalism. Ili nivunje mipaka ya kikabila. To show that I am above my name's tribe. Kuonyesha kwamba mimi niko zaidi ya majina niliyopewa na kabila langu. And if I was a true a, 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 a true mjeru to, to, na, to, na, to, to if, I, if I was a true mjeru today. Na kama ningekuwa mjaluo mwenyewe leo. I, I will not come to, 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 to Nairobi. Singe kuja Nairobi? I will go to Thika. Ningevuka nije Thika. Yeah. Ndio. I will go to Nyeri. Ningeenda Nyeri. Where they speak only ki, ki, Kikwao. Mali wanazungumza lugha ya mama tu. When I preach in Nyeri. Nilipohubiri Nyeri. Wazee came there. Wazee wakaja kunisikiza. Give me a kanzu ya wazee they clothed me a kanzu. Wakanipatia joho la kizee. And they put on me. Walipo iweka kwangu and they call me jamba ya mwadhani kisha wakanibandika jina shujaa wa yesu i i came to know that that is amazing nikaja kujua kwamba ni jambo la kushangaza and then thika nilikuwa hapa thika today in thika leo hapa thika i see many people naona watu wengi we can take nairobi for god basi tunaweza kuteka mji huu wa thika kwa ajili ya mungu we can take thika we can take nyanza we can take tunaweza kuteka miji yote nyanza we, maeneo we, yote we, we can take uh, ukambani pamoja na ukambani yote for christ tunaweza kuteka miji hizi zote can, kwa ajili ya kristo this is taking over thika today huku ni kuteka mji wa thika leo today this is this is invasion Leo huku ni kuvamiwa ni mavamizi. This is not nice preaching and nice being prayed for. Si mahubiri mazuri tu na mambo ya kufanywa maombi. We are talking the very air. Leo tunashambulia hali ya anga yote. And the presence the presence of Jehovah will be here. Na uwepo wa Yehova utakuweko bila shaka. Why do they write the names of victories? Ni kwa nini wakaandika majina ya watu ambao walipokea ushindi katika Biblia? Because God wants to identify you from the others. Ni kwa sababu Mungu anataka akuchambue na kuondoe kati ya mio, miongoni mwa watu. You are not an ordinary person. Maana wewe si mtu tu wa kawaida. No, you are not ordinary. Hapana wewe si mtu wa kawaida. You are special. Wewe ni mtu special. Let me show you how special you are. Waacha nikuonyeshe special wako. You are so special. Wewe ni speciali sana. That God will not accept anyone in your be on your behalf. Kiasi ya kwamba Mungu hangekubadilisha na mtu mwingine yeyote. He accepts you only. Anakukubali wewe peke yako. So I'm not speaking to ordinary kikuyus. Basi mimi sizungumzi wa kikuyu wa kawaida. I'm speaking to extraordinary people. Nazungumza na watu walio zaidi ya kawaida. Sent by divine nature. Ambao mmetumwa na Mungu mwenyewe. May God bless you as you hear this today. Mungu awabariki mnaposikiliza hii leo. Hear this now. Sikiliza hii sasa. One man. Mtu mmoja huyu. How many men? Watu wangapi hapa? Say one man. Sema mtu mmoja. Even you women say one man. Hata nyinyi wakina dada semeni mwanamume mmoja. Man, not a male, not just a male, man. Sio mwanamume tu, ni mtu. Some men are just male. Kuna wanaume wengine ni madume tu. They are, they are nothing but male. Hao ni udume tu anaweza kutuonyesha. Do you hear what I said? Umenisikia? I have done it brother. I have done. I have done. I have done it. I have done it. Just madume. Ni madume tu. Longi. There are no value to the kingdom of God. Hawana manufaa yote wanaleta kwa ufalme wa Mungu. Just madume. 
ni longi tu wamevaa this man huyu mtu aliandikwa hapo he saw israel run aliwaona wana israeli wote wakitoroka mbio and he said we are told by our elders na akasema tumeshaambiwa na wazee wetu you will never turn your backs on your enemy kwamba wana israeli hawapaswi kamwe kuwageuzia maadui migogoro one of you shall chase a thousand kwamba wawili watafukuza elfu moja that is what they were told ndivyo walivyofunzwa but what's happening now is contrary to what we are told lakini kile ambacho Eliezer anaona sasa ni kinyume cha kile ambacho waliambiwa mbeleni so you people are thicker basi ninyi